Hello darlings, welcome back! Quickly before the video starts, I just wanted to show you guys, like, I couldn't fix this chair in PhotoWord, and no matter how I tried. And I wanted to ask you if you met this bug before, or was it like a cheat thing? I have like literally no idea. I think I met another Gardener player uh, that day that this happened. And I remember I could fix the chairs in PhotoWord, but I met this uh, player, this Gardener, twice. And I couldn't fix the chairs she broke in PhotoWord like neither times. So I was just wondering if it was like some kind of a cheat thing, or was it like a bug that only showed up with that player for some reason. So yeah, leave a comment if you if you saw that before. But I like I was really confused. Like why is it the new update or whatever? Yeah. So uh, one of you asked me to post a video or like a gameplay with um, this beautiful deadly invitation accessory. So of course I just wanted to quickly. I had some time and I quickly found the match I previously saved. And uh, here we go. Uh, this is uh, our beautiful wonderful one skin with deadly invitation i think it's a very pretty match um and i think uh it's a very very fun match as well the last part of joseph academy we together with the ceremony uh like the graduation ceremony is in the middle of preparation so i'm really excited um to post that soon and it will have a little surprise and also if you guys didn't see i have a video uh, ready for premiere it will be on uh, december 24th so basically christmas day for us or at least um well part of the word uh and we can watch it together guys it will be me saying uh, my short holiday wishes for you and we can watch three whole minutes of uh terror shocks it's in a little compilation so i hope you guys will enjoy it we will have a live chat going on so join up you can just go uh, to my channel page and uh, see the video there in the uh, among the other videos and you can click notify me so youtube will send you a notification when that video goes live and i will be waiting for you guys there with the live chat so hopefully we can meet there and have a fun night so i would say this match was typically that case when it's basically four randoms and when the rescuer is injured um they like they don't really know who uh would have to save and like you know nobody wants to leave their ciphers nobody uh knows or maybe like uh the enchanters didn't have the trait uh that lets the other survivors see whether the uh, where the other survivors are so maybe that could be the reason but basically none of them came to save which gave me a very nice uh boost i had to save because just when i went to teleport away i had tinnitus uh, pop up so I, I just didn't want to let them get that last minute save and as you can see uh, I did manage to secure that first kill very soon so here I managed to get the uh, merc down thanks to the little photo over damage and uh, I hit him so I hit his mirror also so I could get max presence uh, finally and then I just basically had to wait until photo over the ends because you know uh, I just wanted to chair him normally uh, and then the other two survivors were still full health, but it was fine. I didn't worry too much about it. As you can see, the embalmer and the mercenary were uh, teammates, or like at least I suppose, maybe from the same guild, I'm not sure. So they might have uh, had some communication, maybe in voice chat, not sure. But the decoding, as you can see, it's still pretty fast. Uh, even though this match is from, I think, from the summer, maybe like early summer. I would say but yeah I didn't really risk uh, playing with the SSS3 right now because I don't know for some reason it always lags like I, the max I can use is a B skin and an A accessory but even then there are some lag spikes so that's why I had to uh, choose a gameplay um, I had saved up I have a bunch of them saved up and I do when I get back to them because uh, there are some very exciting matches so I will just get to posting them uh, if you guys don't mind but yeah it's it just really sucks because i really love using jojo's higher tire skins and accessories and it makes it so hard to to play with them because i will constantly lag and it's just terrible but yeah you know jojo is too jojo in his c skin <laughs> so uh that's that's the best you can do uh but thankfully i did find this this footage of um this beautiful accessory with this beautiful skin so i hope you enjoyed it um whoever asked for it one thing I wanted to mention, um, Koa, Call of the Abyss, 
as you can see or as you know uh, is uh, the yearly or annual uh, race or like competition in IDV that they organize is basically a global competition and we get like special skins and accessories and pets and whatnot uh, with the event that you can only claim when you're in a club. Uh, clubs are not the same as guilds so don't confuse them if you are maybe a new player or you haven't been here at the last co-op. Uh, so basically clubs or teams limited to, are limited to seven people and uh, to get these uh, special core rewards and I'm not sure which is the free A skin you can get this way but there is one and there are a bunch of uh, really cool rewards so make sure uh, I think you have like 10 days maybe or maybe seven um, until co starts so try to find yourself a team um, that has an active captain or like a team leader because the team leader has to register to participate in co but don't be scared this is not like you don't have to like actually play competitively it's basically just um, you know just for the reward so it's basically will just count how many matches you play like the whole team and then based on that you can get the rewards without having to participate in anything you can just like play your normal matches except you have to like click uh, on the co event interface and then choose like quick match or normal match or rank match it's basically the same thing so you don't have to be worried it's just for the rewards so if you haven't had a team yet or you noticed your team captain didn't register your team or maybe they are offline uh, for a long time or inactive then maybe just quickly try to find a new team um, my uh, discord server is open for that we try to organize a whole channel uh, for this and like people post whoever has a club and maybe needs members or the people who just need an existing club so if you don't have your club uh, already then try to join our uh, my server the link is uh, always in the description um, and also on my channel page so uh, you can try your luck there I really hope uh, you can get the rewards because sometimes it's really good to just you know um, put these uh, little accessories and free skins into your collection uh, just for like playing which you basically already do meanwhile there is a new vote going on in my community page as always i try to uh, give this like little picture vote for you guys because you guys seem to enjoy it very well or very much uh, right now we are trying to find the top three hottest hunters so uh right now is the fourth normal vote meaning like you know the all the hunters from all the hunters and then there will be our four finalists compete against each other to find out who are like the first second and third of course i really do hope strongly strongly hope that joseph wins first place because if not i don't even know what what the people who voted do on my channel because obviously jojo is best jojo is king uh but i'm excited to see who you guys vote for second and third so if uh you would like to participate in these votes uh just feel free to subscribe and youtube will automatically um show you these votes when you open the app and i think it's a really fun little thing to do i did have one with jojo's skins so if you're excited uh, or you would like to see that video um i will put put a little link to it in the top corner all right that was it for today thank you for watching bye bye